The Vatican's Apostolic Library has one of the biggest and most important collections of historical texts in the world. The history of humanity is recorded through its texts and manuscripts. In the near future, all that information will be accessible to anyone, anywhere. In about four years' time, we'll have about 15,000 manuscripts completely digitized out of a total of 82,000. The Vatican just signed an agreement with Japanese IT services company NTT Data Corporation to digitize part of its historical collection. Priority will be placed on texts and documents from Japan, China, and pre-Columbian America. All the documents will be uploaded to the library's webpage, and people from around the world will be able to access the documents in HD and free of charge. We decided to also include the option to sustain the digitization through donations. We are developing a way to show next to each scanned image who donated or sponsored it. And though it may sound simple, the process is actually pretty complicated. It will be divided in three stages. The first is the scanning of documents using up to five specialized scanners. The work will take place within the library and will train people to avoid any type of damage to the documents. The second stage will be to archive the images on a secure Vatican server. And third is adding it to the library's page online, where users will be able to search and view individual pages or entire texts. There are manuscripts that are very delicate or difficult to handle. During the first phase, which has to run smoothly and rather quickly, we decided to leave aside any complicated cases. The total cost is estimated at about 18 million euros, but the Vatican sees it as an investment in the future. To start off, about 20 workers from the Japanese company will join Vatican employees in making all the documents digital. And as the work progresses, the number of workers will rise to about 50. To date, the Vatican has about 6,800 digitized items, but only about 300 of them are available to view online.